guys, Betsy here with Unique Paper 15. Thanks so much for stopping by today. And I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. Um, this is going to be kind of just like a smorgasbord of a haul. It's a lot of happy mail and um, a couple boxes that I got in that are not craft related, but I'd still like to share them with you. So we're gonna jump right into it because I'm excited and I wanna know what's in these things. So let's do it. Okay, the first thing is my Walmart Beauty Box. You guys, um, I think, are quite familiar with this now. It's $5 per box, including shipping, so you pay $20 a year. They ship it out um, with the Four Seasons, and it's funny because I always seem to get them the same time as I get my FabFitFun box, so um, I don't even like the same day. So I'm going to show you what I got. This is actually my last beauty box but I hadn't opened it yet and I was waiting and I kind of forgot about it and my new FabFitFun box came in so I'm just going to show you now. So this one was Celebrate Your Beauty and they always have somewhat of a theme. The one I'm waiting on right now that I think is going to be this week is uh, I think it has something to do with fashion. I forget. When it gets here I'll show you guys but they always have a theme. So that's the information if you guys are interested. It's the Shop Beauty Box. So um, again, really good price. So this time we got a full size Equate five blade <clears throat> razor for women. And I think you get, oh, and you get two cartridges. That's a really good deal because you guys know razors are expensive, even disposable ones. And I get that you could, you know, buy more cartridges and things like that but these are great when you're you know going on vacation or going away for the weekend and you don't want to take that nice razor that you don't want to lose these are really nice that's what i use a lot of these boxes for is when i do go out of town so this guy uh this degree motion sense ultra clear black white invisible solid okay I'm excited to try that because I wear a lot of black in my work kind of dress and um, I have to dress nice every day except Friday but um, that's one thing down here in South Florida it gets hot so this is something vital for your daily go is you know a good deodorant but I hate it how it does you have that cast of deodorant on you know, whether it's a black, blue, like a dark pink shirt, it doesn't matter what it is. So I'm gonna try this out and then I'll let you guys know by the time the new box comes in, if this guy really was invisible on black and white clothes. So let's see, but it's a full size and it says here, anti-yellow stain and anti-white mark. Now, sorry to be a little gross, but it's real life. Um, my husband, he's a t-shirt guy and he wears a lot of white t-shirts and black t-shirts. And no matter what, his white t-shirts, they do, they turn yellow in the armpits. It's just, I don't know if it's the deodorant or his perspiration, I don't know, but um, I tried a couple things to get it out. I did a vinegar scrub with baking soda and it helped a lot. So, I don't know, just kind of thought I'd share that. Let's see what it smells like. If I can, okay. Oh, it smells clean. I'm handing it like you guys are going to smell it. It smells clean, nothing foofy like flowers or something like that. Um, Aveeno Daily Moisture Lotion Sheer Hydration. I think we're all pretty much familiar with Aveeno and it's sealed of course. Um, Aveeno is really good and I don't know if um, Jennifer Aniston is still doing that whole Aveeno spokeswoman thing. Maybe she is. But I think oatmeal is kind of like, you know, the old school trick to moisture everywhere in the world, right? Okay. Oh, it smells nice. It's not too fragrant, so that's nice. Some people don't like a lot of fragrance. And then this Labella Super Shine Avocado Oil and then Vitamin E Face and Body Oil. I'm huge into serums. I love oils. I use probably three like serum oils in my daily routine routine morning and night I have a morning oil I put on my face a night oil I put on my face and then bio oil which you can get at any drugstore probably grocery store too I love bio oil I actually will coat 
Well, code, that sounds weird. I rub it on my eyes, my eyebrows, and my eyelashes at nighttime. My eyelashes grow, they're so thick, and my eyebrows too. It's like there's a secret super something in that bio oil. I love it. I know it's for um, like discolored skin, anti-aging, moisture, and stretch marks, but it does amazing things for um, just like my face, my arms, anything like that. I had started using it years ago when I was pregnant with my son because they said that and cocoa butter was like the cure to everything and I've just loved bio oil since then. So I'm going to give these a try and plus I put um, I put the oils in my hair too. I really like to keep my, my hair nice and moist. Okay, next one is this purifying, brightening, peeling gel mask is it in let's see peeling gel uh, I don't know if it's a I think it's just gel I don't think it's a mask so you're supposed to remove makeup clean moisten skin and massage just into your face in a circular motion and then wash off okay so it's just like a cleaning kind of thing there I wanted to show you guys the last box I totally forgot I saved it forever maybe I'll bring it up next time it's called donkey milk it's something like this it's a face mask but it's called donkey milk it's so funny I cracked up and I wanted to show you guys and I kept forgetting to bring it up here to the loft but I actually did try it and my face was really really soft the next day so if you guys are looking for a good mask go check out the donkey milk one okay and the last thing in here is Village Naturals Therapy, Aches and Pains Muscle Relief. This is a um, foaming bath oil and body wash. And this is for, okay, so one's muscle and one is nighttime. Uh, this one says for muscle and joint discomfort. And this one says for nighttime aches and stiffness. I'll definitely try these and let you guys know if they're just, you know, kind of a foofy ad or if they really do work. Because that's a, you know, we all kind of have that, muscle and joint discomfort so well those of us that are 30 something are up all right so that's that guy so good stuff for five bucks including shipping right i'm telling you guys this is really a good gift to give somebody for a year 20 dollars gift that it just keeps on giving i think it's fantastic and everybody that has gotten one because of that they all say like it was the best purchase they've made all right ba boom now, I apologize, I didn't get to show you guys my last FabFitFun box because that's when I took that trip to the mountains during the holidays. It was actually during, um, we were there for New Year's as well. But I took that whole last winter box with me on my trip and oh my gosh, it so far was my favorite box. I had gotten a cool mug in there, this beautiful like wraparound type of like blanket scarf, blanket thing. Um, uh, uh, candle this uh, lavender scrub wash this look oh my gosh you guys the last box oh was my favorite so let's see if this one can top it always the great decorations right here's our handy dandy little magazine which is kind of like our guide and then some type of hello fresh offer here that's fifty dollars off your two first boxes um, yeah, I don't know if I could do that, but I mean, for some people, this is probably a really good op or a good option. Maybe if you're single or you know you just don't have time, you have a very busy career. And then the good stuff. All right. Now I just pulled this sticker off. I do not know what's in here yet. So let's go here. This is I S H Lip Statement Palette. All right. Let's get into this and see what it looks like. Now, you guys are probably very familiar with this. It's also four times a year. I believe, don't quote me, I believe the, do the boxes are $49.99, but when I signed up, I got my first box half off, and then I got a coupon for 30% off. So all of my boxes come, I think I pay all together, like with shipping, 39 plus tax. So everything you see here, just imagine $40. I mean, it's phenomenal, and it's only four times a year. It's a luxury, I grant you, but it's a it's a nice luxury. It's like my birthday four times a year. Okay, so a nice little peel away thing to protect the case, and then let's see what does it have here. Oh, in here. Okay, let's do like that. Nice, bright colors, right? 
I don't know, maybe some nudes. Are those all lipstick? I mean, those are some really bright colors, right? I would probably only go for like, maybe the top three over here, like, like whoops, like these ones are here and maybe, maybe that one. I'm not a really bright lipstick kind of person. And then a nice lipstick brush, so I don't wanna blind you guys with that mirror there. But that's nice. So it says, you get 12 one gram lipsticks. Okay, very nice. Um, most of the lipsticks I've ever gotten in these FabFitFuns, I've given away. Uh, there, the one I gave away, I looked it up and it was a really nice lipstick. It was like $26 and it was by a fancy company and blah, blah, blah. It just, I don't wear a lot of dark lipsticks, kind of like my nails. Coral is the darkest I'll wear for nail polish. But, um, yeah, so if you guys ever receive any type of like makeup stuff from me, which I know I have sent some of you stuff like that in perfume, know that it's probably from one of my kits and I just didn't want it, but I didn't use it. So just let me know. Um, okay, this is Etica, Los Angeles, California, 18 karat gold earrings. Soak up the laid back vibes of LA. I like learning about these new companies. But I don't like to see how everything's made in China. Even that uh, lipstick palette there. I'd like to see some made in the USA stuff. Those are cute. Very summery, right? I feel like I should be going to like a taco party or something. I don't know, like where should I be going with these? I'm not really sure. Or maybe, um, I don't know, that event where the ladies do the, the little bells on their fingers. I forget the name of that, but these are very pretty. I would definitely have to have my hair up, but I love the colors. I love how soft those are. But knowing me, I will deconstruct these and turn them into tassels for cards. <laughs> that is probably what I'll do. Okay, next. Rachel Pally, Coral Mint. Now, you have the option of going and previewing, I think, some of the things or all of the things in your box. They give you a few like, hey, do you wanna look? Do you wanna change? Do you wanna request? I never do that because I always want to be surprised, but I know that these vary. So somebody else will be getting a different bag. And it comes in a cute little, like a uh, fabric protected bag. And let's see, so far I'm digging it. Well, this is cool. Maybe it can hold my uh, stamping platform. Let's see. So it's kind of like a pleather on the back here. I wonder if it's waterproof. And a canvasy kind of thing. There's like some marks here. But a canvasy type of front there. Let's see, it has like a little tassel pull there. And is that a pouch? Okay, so it's like a divider inside. Do you guys see that? It's like a little divider guy. And then like a little name tag there. So maybe you could put, I don't know, some travel stuff in there. Not really sure. Is it meant to fold over? Don't know. Okay, but I'll, I'll look at the thing. So nice bag there. Oh, there's the tassel. Okay. Now, what is this? Dermalect. Dermalect. Cos... What? Cos... Whatever. Makeover Concealing Ridge Filler. Ooh, okay. <laughs> I see the word filler. I'm getting excited. Keratin Peptide Infused Professional Lacquer. Oh, for your nails. It's a filler. I'm thinking my wrinkles. Oh my God. Okay. So makeover peptide infused concealer and treatment anti-aging ridge filler. Can you guys see why I got excited? Oh, and there's a coupon in there. Look at that. 20% off. Okay. So I definitely am going to try that out. I always get little like bumps and ridges in my nails. Yeah, I'll definitely try that. Okay. I've just never heard of a concealing nail polish. Okay. Free people. I like free people. Free people and understand leather. With love from Texas. Understated leather. Not understand. Understated leather. Okay, so we're definitely going with the mint, mint theme here. Oh, there's something in here. What's going on? What is this? Oh, it's a cooling mask. It's a cooling pack. Here's the instructions. Okay, let's check it out. Before use, place cooling pack in freezer for no longer than five to 10 minutes. Okay, I don't know if you guys remember, but like two or so boxes ago, I got that long pink 
it was like, you know, if you're cool, you're cool. If you're hot, you're hot. It's like one side gets hot, one side gets cool. I have used that thing for cooling and heating already like maybe 10 times. It is phenomenal. Like sometimes I use it for my monthlies, you know, it's like, you're just like, oh, I need a heat pad. And then sometimes um, I like say my husband had a fever or he hurt himself and I needed something cooling or like I burn myself all the time when cooking. So we used it for that. That thing has been a lifesaver and I never thought I was gonna use it. So um, who knows? I mean, this is <laughs> a tad gaudy for me, I'm just saying, but I mean, my husband's probably gonna crack up if he sees me wearing this, but there were these um, gold under eye masks, like they're little mini under the eye masks that look gold and you put them on, they say for 30 minutes and it is supposed to make your under eyes look really nice. I sleep with these things on and you guys, I wanna buy stock in the company. When I wake up, I look younger. It, I don't know what these things do. I don't know if they just pull moisture to that area. My eyes are not dark. They're like voluptuous underneath. Like they're not like so hot. I just, oh my God, those, I'll try to post them down below. Those things are amazing and they're affordable. So maybe this combined with that will make my eyes look a little better. Not that my eyes look horrible, but you know. Okay, next. Murad Skin Perfecting Lotion Fluid Hydrate Lightweight Oil-Free Moisture to use massage evenly on face, neck, and chest. Follow with a sunscreen during the day. Okay, let's smell it. Murad's pretty good stuff in my experience. Let's see if it, what? Okay, well, let's do it here because I have lotion there. Okay. Oh, no scent absolutely no scent and they're right it's not oily that's nice okay I'll definitely give that a try now I like how they're putting all the instructions and everything inside how am I supposed to read that I mean I guess I'll just deconstruct well don't need that one I'll just tear the box apart and read it if that's my language okay next dove exfoliating body polish crushed macadamia and rice milk that's cool they're like little mini body polishes. In shower or bath, scoop a generous amount and polish with hand, spread all over in circular motion and rinse. Let us know what you think. Really cool. I'll definitely let you guys know what I think about that. Okay, next, let's go here. This looks fun. It's like a camouflage lip pouch. How many lips can you find? I think that's cute. Okay, it says KNC Beauty. Little zip bag here. What's going on? Oh God, do you guys remember when I bought some of these? Some of you have them. The 24 karat gold lip masks. That's what these are, but they're collagen. Okay, so what I was just telling you about the under the eye, the one that looks like a little horseshoe, it's the exact same concept. It's not by this company though, but holy cow, I love them. I know, sorry to be dragging on about it, but if you guys want good looking under eyes, I will do my best to link it down below so you guys can try them out. Okay, so I guess it conditions, moisturizes, plumps, and hydrates your lips. Apply to clean lips for 15 to 20 minutes. Recommended use two to three times a week. Okay, yep, so I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna do that with my eyes and my eye mask and my little moisturizer there and see if my face is nice and puffy. Okay. What's going on here? Something's going on there. Okay, let's do this guy first. Number 14, Super Bloom. Basil, tangerine leaf, anise, violet, geranium, lily of the valley, jasmine, rose, rosewood, and cashmere musk. Wow, this better be a candle. Yep, okay. Ooh, look, it's copper, you guys. Oh, it smells so good. I wish you guys could smell this. It kind of smells like leather with flowers. Yeah, it smells like like some like you walked into maybe a man's office and he has a brand new leather couch, but yet a girl with pretty perfume was just sitting in it. That's what this smells like. It's really nice. That's the best description I can give. It smells really good. I like that. I wish I could let you guys smell it. I'm definitely gonna try that up here 
in the loft so that my area smells nice. And let's see what's going on here. Okay, this is massage roller, serious results for serious relief. Use this massage roller after an intense physique 57 workout. Can I do a different workout? Let's see. Okay, they're giving some type of free month trial here to some type of like workout place on what, what on demand physique 57 and there's fab 18 if you guys are interested see results in eight workouts now i did use something similar to this not this but i was having um some type of problems with the muscles on my hip and um i think it's called brusitis you guys might be familiar with it and they recommended not this not only for my hip but for like my hamstring and that area and you um like say this is your leg you roll it down and it really did help like i'm putting it behind my back right now like almost like my hands are in handcuffs and rolling it up and down my lower back and i kind of want to stop the video and just keep doing this that feels really good wow i wonder how much these are that's actually quite nice okay you guys, so look, don't know how much this doohickey is, but we'll find out. You've got the five lip masks. You have the very nice eye cooling mask. You have this little sample of Dove. You have this amazing smelling candle. You have this beautiful Rachel Pally bag, which I honestly don't know what to do with yet. I'll figure something out. But um, I mean, this is a really nice bag, especially for, you know, beachy things down here in South Florida. You also have these beautiful, uh, really earthy earrings. This whole entire 12 palette lip kit. This really nice Murad Skin Perfecting Lotion. This Nail Makeover Ridge Filler. And then also some coupons and things for $40. I mean, remember, it's more than that, but if, you're, if you look around and you do the coupons, you can, you can get what I got it for. So let's just see how much everything kind of went for, and then we'll move on. Okay, so you see some people get different things. Okay, so there's the lip guy right there. Don't know how much it is. I have just kind of scanned to see if um, you can see it. Oh my God, it's Alex Garza. That She's a YouTuber. You guys know her? That's her lip palette. How funny. Yep, I know Alex. How? Congratulations, Alex. Wow, I've been watching her on YouTube for years. And let's see here. Okay, I was just trying to see if um, it said how much it is. Because, you know, they sometimes they give you the prices. Maybe it'll be in the back. All right, and then let's see. What are they talking about there? They're talking about the bag. Her new bag. Or clutch. I'm sorry, it's a clutch. And then they're talking about there is the eye mask and then the roller. There's the lip thing, oh God. And then the lotion and the nail. And see, that's what I was talking about with like your um, like your quad muscle, like that. That's what I was actually doing with it. And then there's the earrings, the candle. Again, with that little like purse thingy majiggy. And then a dove sample. And I don't think they're gonna give us a price breakdown. They might, um, but usually what it is, is it comes out to be like $198 with a stuff and you get it for a quarter of that. So, all right guys, that's that. I hope you like it. Let's do some um, happy mail. All right. Ooh. One thing I wanted to show you before I do a happy mail is I forgot to show you this in the last video. When I got my Gemini, I also got this. If you guys um, know about them, I got them from HSN, same as the Gemini, and they were having a special for $20, again, in five payments, if you wanted to do it that way, of these frame cards from uh, Crafter's Companion. Now, there's different ones. You have Birthday Wishes Cupcake. You guys might know about these. Um, they have, let's see, let me break it up so you guys can see quick here. The next one is this one, which is like a birthday rose kind of deal or flower I should say the next one is this guy right here the champagne glasses then you have your like sweet kind of tray there with flowers 
then you have this just for you cupcake and then the just to say thank you the birdhouse let's see i like the birdhouse and then on your special day and then this is the one i made for my mother-in-law and just like a little mason jar of flowers so they teach you really quick how to do it so that's your base like that's your actual base that you fold like that these all coordinate with all of the cards there that I just showed you right and what you do is you fold them around they they give you everything you need to make this little frame here even the tape and then you just glue that on and then they also give you this whole entire pack of envelopes and everything you can make like this like you can make it in a minute everything out the door and including the tape like I said so they give you this really nice kit to make these envelopes as well and then boom in the mail this guy's going all the way to Israel but I wanted to show you guys before I sent it out so I think this is a fantastic deal so you get the 20 cards and the 20 envelopes for $20 so it breaks down to a dollar a card which is really nice for what you get there so I wanted to show you guys in case you're interested okay so that was HSN all right moving on to happy mail now what a really good like week for me every like buddy's been sending me happy mail it's just been kind of rolling in the door I'm so excited about it <clears throat> okay so let's start off with my friend Addison my friend Addison she's a young girl and she is in elementary school and we became pen pals uh, last year and she made this beautiful uh, letter and I wanted to show you guys it actually made it perfectly the mail like this like there's this little sticker on top here and here and this butterfly that's three-dimensional and the post people did not disturb it at all they let this thing ride through the mail like that so kudos to the postman so look what she made remember guys she's young so she made this awesome flip book look at this she did the bloom with the flower tape and the pot and the ladybug tape she did this beautiful like flower arrangement and this bike that says let's go outside i mean let's go play outside and then this awesome bunny thing here with and she cut out an egg she did a mushroom that says spring with a butterfly and some flowers. And then she made this little envelope that says you're the bestest in the whole bunch with a bunch of strawberries and a strawberry sticker. And it has a little tie thing here to open up. And then she made a little pocket letter with coordinating flowers that you can pull this out. Look at that, you are my sunshine. Is this not amazing? I mean, her skills are just improving. I mean, I've watched her art grow over the past year and just very impressed. And then she did a three-dimensional um, bunny down here. And so it closes like this. And then you have wild and free April, sh April showers, bring May flowers with the umbrella. And then you have more umbrellas here. And this is a cloud with a bunch of rain coming out of it. And then of course, everything's kind of connected with the, the April showers and the flowers you know I think this is really nice she coordinated everything amazing so Addison great job honey I think this is one of your best pieces ever keep up the great work all right next I wanted to show you um, I got a happy meal from my friend Bon Marie now this is special because she introduced me to this memory decks thing so I just got my first one and now I'm sending hers hers out but I have made a lot. So if any of you are also into the memory decks, maybe you could um, connect with Von Marie and I or whoever else, and we could also switch some because now I have a lot <laughs> to send out. So this is what Von Marie sent me. I think it's beautiful. She made a shaker egg and filled it with sequins of all blues. I think this is gorgeous. And then put a little mini, um, wobbler here with the bunny and this cracks me up thinking of you makes me do binkies i think this is so cute and then she put the back of the bunny so he's like going through the card and then she put her information so i think that's really cool i 
I uh, didn't know that, but I've now added it to my memory decks cards, and it makes sense because you're gonna go through your memory decks and know a little bit about all of your friends. So I think that's fantastic. And she had this awesome tissue paper of balloons. I don't know where she got this, but this is really cool. So I wanted to show you guys that. So here's what she has sent along with this awesome memory decks card. She has put this ribbon through these grommets that are really, really cool. So she's taken some paper mache and glued it in like a ruffle bound kind of way. I think this is really neat. Like it's all pleated. And she made this rabbit with a mesh shaker window. Is that cool or what? And then it's like sewn on. I think that's really, really neat. So you have this like lace doily, then you have this. It really has like a, a handmade sewn vibe. I really like that. So here's the ribbon. We're gonna go ahead and take that out so we can get into it. And she's made a flip pocket letter book. I love it. So she's done some lambs, Easter. Spring and Easter was the theme. She stuffed it here with an envelope with tags, which I love opening all these little crevices and windows that you guys do. She did a really cool wax paper pocket here with a cloud and she did some really nice tags with some gold reinforcers. I like that. Then she's gone ahead and put a little, let me see here, little saying right here, no bunny is as sweet as you. So now I know I need to dig inside there. Another cute little envelope. And she's given me some wooden embellishments. They look like teddy bears. Very cute. I actually know what I'm gonna do with those. Um, then, on the back here, I don't know if you can see it, but there's this tiny, tiny little envelope. Look at this. She's actually put something inside of here. Look at this. This is so adorable. I love stuff like this. You're sweet. Is that not adorable? I don't know if she made this with that mini um, We Are Memory Keepers uh, envelope maker. If she has, wow, that's tiny. Okay, next page. Oh, happy day. She's made me this awesome, look at this, this paper clip. She's always good at paper clips though. This cute little felt bunny on this pink clip. A nice burgundy hot pink arrow clip. Some carrots growing here. And then another pocket. And look, it's a stamp from Whimsy, Whimsy Stamps. This is Summer Rolls. And it's got a little crab holding a watermelon. Is that fun? And it's red rubber. That's a really nice stamp. Thank you, Vamari. And then she's made a whole entire pullout of like, let me scoot this over, of acetate or clear pockets. So she's put some paper in there, some awesome sequins, and some tags and embellishments for me to use along with some twine. And I'm going to use these. I'm actually gonna dive in and use all of this stuff. And then I see here, read. So there's something in here she wants me to read and it's for me. Is that so cute? And I like how she's done this. It's, it looks like tape, but it's actually like a pocket for the tip of the envelope. And it has a cute little rabbit on a carrot with a chickie. And you can see that it says like, you're extra special to me underneath. And then hand or made with love by Bon Marie. Is that so cute? I absolutely adore this. I love this type of creative paper craft. This is, I love doing this type of stuff now more than I think any other um, form of art. So the other side looks like this. Is that not cute? And she did another signature stamp here. She did some paper layering, but I love these like rivet, these grommet rivets. I absolutely love how she's done that and how creative to run this ribbon all the way through. I think that's really, really clever. Well done, Von Marie. thank you so much. And again, if you guys are interested about this memory decks kind of swap, please, you know, say something. Let's connect on Instagram. I know there's a big hashtag I'm following, so I'm really interested. All right, next is from my friend Tamara. Totally surprised me by this because she just got done sending me that awesome Alta new stamp set. And um, I had ordered her something too. And 
knowing my luck, and it did happen, somehow the package, it originated and then went to Arizona. And instead of going east to Florida, the USPS messed up. It got on the wrong plane and went to Hawaii and has sat there for two weeks. So the company that I ordered from, they saw that this has happened and they sent out a new package, but Tamara, I'm so sorry. Like, I don't know what to say. It's my luck. So here's what she sent me. This awesome candy. They're like butterscotch candies. And I don't know how to read that, but I'm gonna give it a try. Zewus Room Butter Babalars. And I want you guys to check out this lady's hair because this kind of sums up the whole thing. Do you see this? Okay, now remember, that's like that for a reason because uh, that's how the candies are wrapped, okay? So let me show you what I mean. This is how the candies are wrapped. Is that cool? That's how her hair is. It's like funky and she's got butterscotch coming out of her head. I think that is great. And she says that this is a tradition from the town that she's from. So I think that is great. And of course, we all tried them and love them. And they come in this really cool uh, bag here. So yeah, thank you. These are like our sweets. All right. Um, I guess let me start by showing you the card. She made this awesome card here that says uh, Stamp Besties. And I love how she did this rainbow burst. That is awesome. I really like that. And then she's done a lot of these little epoxy or resin embellishments all the way around, but she coordinated the colors. I think that's really clever. Really, really cute. And I don't know if you guys have seen this, but she has a new signature stamp. She used to have the, stick, the black stickers, Handmade with Love by Tamara Haverkamp. I love that. It's so like professional. And it came in this really pretty um, envelope that she's made that says, you've got mail. I think that's so cute. All right, let's move on to the next thing she sent. This beautiful um, oriental coin purse. Is that cool? Look at that. It has a nice little pull tag here. And it's from Kimmy Doll. If you guys are familiar with Kimmy Doll. Isn't that nice? I think that's awesome. I'm gonna put this in my purse. I really like that. I think that's unique. It's a circle, you know? You don't see a lot of circle purses. She also sent me this really cool Echo Park uh, paper pack for Easter. Oh my, she always sends the best paper though. Look at this. All the Easter stuff. If you guys are familiar with it, you have the pink bunnies, the plaid, flowers, more awesome plaid, more awesome plaid, Easter eggs, chickies coming out of their eggs and not, bunnies with carrots, a bunch of Easter sayings, which is really cute, and I love those carrots there. A bunch of runners, which I love. Here comes Peter Cottontail, hop right, let's see. Here comes Peter Cottontail right down the bunny trail. Said hip hop, hippity, oh gosh, and rap song. <laughs> I did not just rap for you guys. Chocolate bunnies, and then we're at our repeat. I think this is so cute, it's so pastel -y. okay. Next, she sent me this cute little, like, Cupid bear. He's got a whole entire bucket of bows and arrows. I should say arrows, and then he's got his bow here. But look how cute that is. I love it. He's like a little chubby bear. I love it. Then, she sent me two of these, like, sticky bookmarks with all these really cool endings here, like hearts and stars, and it says, you know, love this, don't forget, and, you know, to get done. And then a book, literally, of more sticky notes. I love stuff like this. Um, my other friend had just sent me, um, Amanda had sent me this like thing of Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then also don't forget. I've been using them like crazy and they're kind of the same concept, so I'm gonna put these in my planner as well. I absolutely love stuff like that. Then, it gets better. A stamp set from MFT. Is this awesome? It's the You and Me Forever, and it has all the little sheaf on there. It'll be You and Me Forever. I love you so much. Wishing you a happy birthday. Many thanks, yous. I think that's funny. You go, girl, and just for you. And then you have some embellishment flowers here in the heart and grass. 
Is that so cute? I was thinking about doing one of those, um, those like, you know, the slider reveal card along with an LED light in there. I thought that would be kind of cute with these little sheep. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. We'll see how it goes. Um, and then an MFT die. Look at that. It's like the entire skyline of Paris. Is that so cool? What's it called? Does it have a name? Oh, Paris Skyline. There you go. <laughs> that's what it's called because that's what it is. I think that is awesome. I have the, um, I believe it's the Avery L City Skyline. I'm going to try to mesh those together and see if I can't make something cool. But wow, that's awesome. That's a nice die. She also sent another pack of dies by Creative Expression. And these are awesome. These are like, um, like corner pieces that you can, you know, really add a lot of embellishment to your cards, envelopes, anything with. Those are beautiful. So I'm going to be using those a lot. They're really flourishy. Okay. Then more, a whole entire stamp set from Crafters Companion. Um, it's an unmounted rubber stamp, but that's okay. Cause guess what? I just bought the actual cling foam from Amazon. I bought one sheet of it because I wanted to mount some of my purple onion ones because as you know, they don't come mounted and that can be really hard in your stamp positioning tools. So how perfect that I just ordered that and now I can mount these too. I think that's perfect, but let's look at it. Forever Friends, Spring Story, Make a Wish, and you have the mama mouse here with the babies in the wheelbarrow. Sweet April showers do spring May flowers. And then I just love this. She has all of her little toys here, or his. I like this. And then you have the birthday bouquet, especially for you. Playful spring, and another little bouquet here. And then look at all those little cupcake and muffins. And the cake stand and happy birthday to you. I think that's a great stamp set and they're large. Look at that, you guys. It's a whole entire sheet. So I'm going to definitely be uh, making some cards with that. Thank you, Tamara. I love everything and I really do. Uh, I'm hoping that your package gets here soon because I promise I'm not holding it hostage. I will send it as soon as I can. Okay, and the last happy mail I have is from my friend Karen. It actually just arrived like 10 minutes ago. She sent this beautiful card here. Oops. And you guys might be familiar with this. She posted it on Instagram that she made this cute little shamrock guy with this beautiful rainbow and these uh, gold coins here. And then she stuffed it with all this awesome confetti. And I love how she's got the little leprechauns in here along with the shamrocks. That is so awesome. I absolutely love this card. And then she has her sticker here, Karen's cards, and then with her signature. Isn't he so cute? Look at the rainbow, you guys. Look at the cheeks. Look at the shading on the scarf and the jacket. She did a great job. I really, and I like how she made the hat out of like glitter paper. I think that's so cute. Okay. Now, she sent me a pin that's Irish for a day. I'm so excited. I love that. I actually have one Irish pin and I wore it last year on a green scarf because that was like all the Irish stuff I had for St. Patty's Day. So I'm definitely going to keep that to wear it. Then she sent these cute, cute, cute socks that say Happy St. Patrick's Day with a little leprechaun on there. Is that so cute? I love it. I'm going to wear those. I'm going to put them on as soon as this video is over. Then another pair of socks that are Harry Potter. And it has, I can't even say that, something totalis. Petrificus, petrificus totalis. And then you have on the bottom there, Harry Potter. Are those so cute? I love it. They're like gold. Then a whole entire bag of a sequin mix of blues. Is that cool or what? That's a lot. You have dark blues, light blues, aqua blues, whites. Look at all that. That's a very generous sequin pack. <laughs> and more sticky tabs. She had sent me my mushroom ones. Actually, let me show you because I use them all the time. She sent me these a long, long time ago, I think for my birthday. 
and I think these are so cute and I think they're the same company I love these I use them all the time and so now she sent me these cute little duckies I love it and actually I was just coloring some duckies in um, a card that I was making so maybe I can incorporate these somehow so that is it guys that is my happy mail that's my fab fit fun that's my um my walmart box that's everything karen thank you so much i appreciate everything tamara i love everything addison thank you so much um everybody who has sent me things von marie i love this memory dex card and everything you sent um if you guys would like to connect on instagram and maybe become pen pals or if you have a young child that's looking for a pen pal kind of like addison was let me know i'm happy to send a card or something little and uh, if you're not subscribed please do if you like the video give me a thumbs up but definitely come back for more bye guys have a good day